Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the 12th HR Network National Awards Gala Dinner. Thanks to you all once again for attending. I wish the finalists all the very best. Remember, there are no losers this evening, only winners, because the bar's open till late. God bless, and have a wonderful evening. Thank you. The winner of the Learning and Development Award goes to... 3UK. As was already said, you're all winners, but the winner for this category is Anna Walker, Scottish and Southern Energy. Well done. And the winner of the Strategic People Project of the Year 2018 is Scottish Rugby. Brody's LLP HR Graduate of the Year 2018 winner is Veronica Gruber, Strathclyde Business School. The SSE Corporate Responsibility of the Year Award winner 2018 is Tata Consultancy Services. And the winner is Tenants. And the winner is Jennifer Sterling from Tenants. The winner of the Robertson Training Employee Engagement of the Year Award goes to Nucleus Financial. Thank you very much. And the winner of the HR Assistant Officer of the Year 2018 is Melissa Cotter. And the winner is CYBG. The Scottish Power HR Manager Advisor of the Year 2018 is Jennifer Morton. The winner of the very first Health and Wellbeing Award of 2018 is Historic Environment Scotland. Winner is Standard Life Aberdeen.
winner of the Tesco Bank Best Employer Workplace of the Year 2018 is Nucleus Financial. It's my absolute pleasure to announce that the BIT Chief Executive of the Year Award goes to Hilary Roberts. Well done, Hilary! LHH Penna, HR Director of the Year 2018 is Carol Henry. Ladies and gentlemen, receiving their award from Craig, the recipient of this year's Outstanding contribution to Scottish HR is Strathclyde Business School. Best Learning and Development Award tonight, which is absolutely amazing. I didn't really think we were going to win. I mean, it's been a huge piece of work for us and the team, and a huge team effort, so we were all very excited, but didn't really expect to win, so when we won, it was an amazing surprise. The lead up to it uh, is, uh, there's quite a bit of momentum building, so it's, it's just such an amazing atmosphere with everybody that's there on the night, uh, and obviously, when they, they made the announcement, um, it was quite overwhelming. Absolutely and utterly delighted, specifically for the other members of the team that were involved in, in the whole programme. Um, so utterly delighted and, and hugely appreciative of the award. It's a huge accolade for us as a business and also um, for all the work that we've done in our, it was a strategic um, people project of the year that we won. So I was actually in the toilet putting on my lipstick, getting myself ready for the, uh, the award dominies and my colleague ran into the toilet screaming at me that I'd won. <laughs> so I'd half my lipstick on, half my lip liner on and I'm running down the stage and my boss is hauling me up the stage. Uh, so it was a bit of a whirlwind um, collecting my award job. Exciting but I was more concerned about my team actually because I think they were desperate for me to win. I think it's an absolutely brilliant event. It showcases the HR community brilliantly and Lee has done nothing other than a, an outstanding job in terms of creating a community of people who are totally engaged in what they do. And what he's done for the HR community in the last 12 years is quite astonishing. His vision, his energy, um, his passion for bringing the HR community together in Scotland is just amazing and uh, everyone really respects him. Uh, and as I say, what he's done for the profession is unrivalled. I think it's absolutely fantastic to see just the size and scale of the event and um, it's just great to see so many HR professionals coming together um, and celebrating the difference that they are making in the workplace. I would really encourage people to make an application um, for the different awards. I think it's great um, to be recognised. I think it's great to showcase um, the different um, activities that many organisations are doing across many different industries. I'll absolutely go for it, go for it. It's been a really great experience. 
um, through from doing interviews and, and just meeting some of the judging panel and then um, the nominees lunch so definitely go for it.